same time. Now less than five hours to go until the first presidential debate of the election. It'll be the first face-off between President Trump and Democratic nominee former Vice President Joe Biden. It all comes amid that bombshell New York Times report about the president's taxes. Let's give you a live look right outside the debate hall. This is at uh, Case Western University. They're in Cleveland, Ohio. The stage is set. But like so many things this year, the debate's going to be different than what we're used to seeing because of the pandemic. Government affairs reporter Melissa Russo in the newsroom with a preview for us. Hi, Melissa. Hi, Natalie. One of the biggest political moments in years, and there will undoubtedly be fireworks tonight, but no traditional handshake when Joe Biden and President Donald Trump meet in Cleveland. Not even an elbow bump during tonight's corona conscious face off. En route today from the White House to the debate in Ohio, more questions about the president's tax returns. Mr. President, who do you owe money to? Don't the American people deserve to know? Ignoring questions like that one won't be as easy during tonight's debate. President Trump's advisors are projecting confidence in his performance, insisting Donald Trump doesn't need this debate to turn around any sagging poll numbers. We absolutely believe the public polls are wrong. They've never been right about President Trump. If public polls were accurate, we would have President Hillary Clinton running for re-election right now. Of the 80 to 100 people attending tonight's venue on the Case Western campus, pending negative COVID tests, just three will appear without masks. The president, Joe Biden. Biden and moderator Chris Wallace. Team Trump now pushing a newer narrative that his opponent is a champion debater after months of suggesting Biden is senile or even using performance enhancing drugs. They give him a big fat shot in the ass and he comes out. <laughs> and for two hours, he's better than ever before. You know? He doesn't know how to debate the facts because he's not that smart. In terms of Joe Biden, we're so proud of him. I always just say to him, just be you. Just show your authenticity, your sincerity, your vision for America. Biden has been deep in debate prep for weeks, and aides say he's expected to focus heavily on the president's record on the pandemic and his controversial tax returns. The president's team says Trump has been rehearsing less formally with aides like Kellyanne Conway and Rudy Giuliani, and also using recent news conferences to test out some of his arguments. Hunter. Biden got three and a half million dollars from the wife of the mayor of Moscow. Why did he get three and a half million dollars? And then he got millions more than we thought from Ukraine, and he got millions more than we heard about from China. The president said to be planning to go after the business dealings of Joe Biden's son tonight and possibly also trying to blame Joe Biden himself for writing the very tax code that he's being accused of taking advantage of. Biden and his running mate Kamala Harris released their 2019 tax returns today in advance of tonight's anticipated showdown. Natalie. All right. We know you'll be watching and have us covered. Melissa, thank you. Remember, you can watch the entire debate right here on News 4 New York. Coverage starting at 9 o'clock. Then join David and me for News 4 New York at 11.